Question by Bridget Campbell. Uh, can you say more about amnesia sometime? How does it work? Did we tell ourselves not to remember? Or is it our nervous system just too small for full recall? In most cases, ha-ha. Or is it something else? Oh, your nervous system is entirely capable of remembering everything. Your brain is not. Your, your nervous system can run the information very, very quickly. But your brain cannot. Because your brain thinks. And full recall entails that you just accept a knowingness of something. And that knowingness is not, because you are in a human brain, you can't, you can't access all of that knowingness at once within a human brain. Now, I could do it all, you can do it all day long outside the human brain, but you have to go outside the human brain, and the human brain likes to think, and that is the downfall. That's how it works. Human brains think. So you have to go outside of thinking into knowingness, and knowingness is not using the brain at all. And I'm a big brain user, so I know this very, very, very well. And I'm a straight-A student, love school, uh, yeah, I really wish that I could have gone to school forever. It just doesn't pay well to be a student for the rest of your life. But certainly that was my, that was my favorite thing, was to go to school and to think, think, think. But the brain thinks. And thinking is, makes it very, very limited. It's very good for what it is made for. A human brain is made to fractal down into the lower vibrations. But it is not built for accessing all knowledge at once. Uh, but you certainly but can use the brain and access a bit of knowledge. You can ask a specific question using your brain. Your brain can go, consider, 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 think, think, think. I've got a question. Okay, clear my mind. Ask the question. You'll get that answer. Uh, it, it totally is able to do that. But it is very, very much, you have to, it's kind of like your laptop. Laptop has access to all information. All the information is available through that laptop. But you have to pull up Google search and you have to type in specifically what you ask for. And even then, um, you're going to get a bunch of data that you can't even begin to sort through. So you have to narrow that question down and narrow that question down to get the exact answer that you want. That's the brain. A computer's like computer is to the internet as the brain is to all knowledge. That makes sense? Should make sense. That seems easy to me. So, yeah, you can access all of it. Now, I can totally go into a meditative state. I can shut my brain all, out, off altogether. I can access the all that is and have all information, all knowing at one time. But... When I come back down and talk to you, now I'm using the brain again. And now the access is back to limited. Does that make sense? Hopeful, hope so. If not, ask me another question down below, and I will try to answer it. All right? Thank you guys for all of your support. Please subscribe and thumbs up for me. And, uh, yeah, I'll check you later. Huge hugs. And uh, bye now.